I use my fidget spinners at Isley to help me focus in class whenever, my, whenever I'm doing my work. Jaden Tedlock is one of many kids caught up in the fidget spinner craze, and chances are if you have kids in school, you know what these toys are. But for Jaden, they're much more than a toy. Uh, it's helped my son in particular focus. Um, he has a... Uh, um, he doesn't have a hard time focusing in general, but with his dyslexia, it helps him stay focused. I don't see how that can be a distraction. Jason Tedlock was out shopping no for the fidget spinner Monday. He says his son's teacher is fine with the toy as long as it doesn't become a distraction. And if anything, it's only a distraction for Jaden's disorder. They can take that spinner and spin it on their hand and sit there and balance it. and. They don't even pay attention to it. They're paying attention to what you're talking about or whatever. And then, you know, it's just, they use both, you know, their brain equally. So you want to make sure that all your sizes are perfect. Brian Huber's getting in on the craze as well, or cashing in. Huber builds the toys locally with the help of his laser printer and says he's sold roughly 1,000 of them in a short amount of time. Very popular right now. I uh, really didn't even know what one was until about three, four months ago. Um, kind of saw what they were made of and I knew we had the equipment in place so thought we would try, try our hand at it. 